doing nighttime in Kosovo over here. How's it going? Look at this, look at this. I've been to Europe, I've done Europe. I, they booked me for a show, I'm not making this up, in Paris. I don't know why no one had a sense of humor there. No one here is from Paris. Let's talk about them for a minute. I've come to the conclusion the French have got to be the most miserable tourists, at least, that visit New York City. They're the only ones, if you've ever been there, that they just don't get into New York. They compare New York to wherever the hell they're from. You see them walking around, Je pense qu'il fait très bon, c'est que c'est la Fifth Avenue. C'est le bourgeois américain du restaurant et au bon pan. Ce n'est pas bon, c'est bon, c'est ma bonbon. But when I tell you the French don't get New York, I'm not making this up. The other night we're out to dinner in New York, my friend brings along this French kid named Henri. Fucking Henry. <laughs> the kid tells me, the kid tells me everything in New York is different from Paris. I said, what? He said, even the Chinese are different. They are short, they are round, they have black spiky hair, and they speak Spanish. <laughs> I said, those are Mexicans, you idiot. This is nothing. I did this for me. This is so a, a cakewalk for me. I did a show. I did a show. I'm not making this up. In Munich. If ever there's a place a Jew does not need to be doing shows, <laughs> Munich is pretty much that place. Not even there. I'm flying out there. I took Lufthansa. Give me that. I took Lufthansa, Hitler's private airline. I'm buckled into the chair, the steward I comes on. I swear to you, she spoke a half hour in German, three seconds in English. I learned one thing, how to say Germany in German. Who knows how? That's it, yeah, were you on the flight? She began, she began. Meine Damen und Herren, wenn wir die Tirade gefilmt haben, bricht es in der Reihe, wir gefilmt haben, wir reiben uns gleich, wir gerüchten, die Rüfte reibt, eine Welt, eine Reibe, dann geht er weg von der USA. Boah. Läufen, Grip, Läufen sind in Deutschland, über der Deutschland, über der Deutschland. I said, who the hell booked me on this flight? Then she goes into English. Then she goes to Israel, ladies and gentlemen, with the following passengers, please indicate where they are seated. <laughs> passenger Haufman, Passenger Goldberg, Passenger Schwartz, and Modi. <laughs> Once the passengers have been eliminated, illuminated, <laughs> they can begin service. She goes, what, what is your name? What is your name? What is your name? I said, Modi, we have you on the paper as Mordechai. <laughs> When you want a kosher meal, you will eat schnitzel like everybody else. Oh, this is fun. This is fun. I've been gaining weight. I've been gaining weight. That's why I'm in dark clothes here. You know you're gaining weight when you walk around like this. Shit, is that me? <laughs> so I figured, hey, I belong to a gym. Why not go? I got to the gym. Now, the first thing you do there is you look for someone thin. Ask him, how do you lose weight? She told me, take a step class. Clap your hands if you've ever taken a step class. Clap your hands. Right, let me rephrase the question. Have any men here ever taken a step class? No. It's not where a man belongs. I got to this class. First of all, I don't know who the hell's losing weight there. I never saw such fat things in my life. It was like a moose convention pulled in. And, and they're all territorial. This is my step. This is my step. This is my space. I need space to turn, she said. I said, sweetheart, with that ass, you need blinkers to turn. <laughs> now, I had my step in the back of the room, and my view was right up their asses. And I don't know who told them it was okay to wear spandex, but it's not. They're all in spandex with a body suit shoved so far up their ass. If they would have, God forbid, fart, it'd be like a slingshot across the entire room. In comes the instructor, five foot nothing, anorexic thing, hasn't been fed in nine months. She puts on the Madonna headgear, hits the groovy music, and the step class began. Together with a right, together and a left. 
together. I'm stepping. Things are going okay at this point. She said, we're gonna use the step together, right together, and step up. Step down. <laughs> step up. St and I'm thinking it's a step. What the hell more do you do with it? Little did I know, together, right, there are little calls she has, and every cow in the room knew exactly what to do. She said, the right together with the left together and straddle. And around the world, then she went straddle, two, three, four, back, left, cottage cheese thighs everywhere. And I'm at a thing like, oh my God, help! Help! Then she yelled, help! Then she yelled, kick the chalk, and they went, kick, two, three. I tried to get in sync, I kicked one, two, three, and my foot got caught in this woman's ass. And I don't want those Ann Nikes back. My name is Modi, thank you very much.